I will just kill our own men. Stand down. Hello everyone, in this video we will explain the mechanical part of drawing and shooting of the open source repeating crossbow. Before explaining the program, let's take a look at the main part, ratchet and pole of this repeating crossbow. A ratchet and pole change the continuous rotation or reciprocating motion into one-way stepping motion. Unlike most ratchet and pole, the driving part here is the pole. The pole is hinged to the pole bracket on the servo and can only be rotated in one direction. In order to let the pole restore in place after it is rotated, we install a rubber band for the pole here. When the two servos drive the pole to alternately wiggle, the lower slider is driven to pull the bow string. We need two servos to alternately wiggle so that the other servo keeps the slider in place while one of them is wiggling forward. When discharging, the two servos lift the pole at the same time and the slider will shoot the bullet. We can adjust the shooting power by increasing or decreasing the number of the rubber bands in the front of the crossbow. The principle of automatic loading is, the slider blocks the bullet in the magazine. When it is put to the back, a bullet falls and the next bullet is blocked by the previous bullet. Next is some key size parameters on which you can base to expand. Now that you have learned about the ratchet and pole of the repeating crossbow, we will explain the principle of Python code in the following tutorial. You can control this crossbow with other programming languages based on this principle. Please subscribe and thank you for watching.